Welcome into the recap of the White Sox 7-5 win over the Cleveland Guardians at Progressive Field in Cleveland, Ohio on Tuesday evening. I'm David Kaplan. It's brought to you by Wintrust, home of White Sox checking. Get one of these super sweet White Sox debit cards. You're not just swiping, you're making a statement. Click on the QR code on your screen or go to Wintrust.com slash Sox for all the details. Member FDIC. Folks, that's a quality win, and you had to overcome adversity early in the game to record that win. Sox have been shut out four times in the first 10 games. They're one and nine. The lineup they started tonight makes no sense to me, first of all. It averaged 29.7 years of age. If you're going on a rebuild, what are you doing playing all these old guys? Martin Maldonado and Robbie Grossman, and guys who have no future when the club is hopefully going to be good again. That's on the manager. That's Pedro. But guess what? In the first inning, Grossman walks, and then they start moving the line. They come up with hits. Andrew Vaughn gets a hit. And they find a way to play a couple runs. And you could see guys are high-fiving in the dugout. People are excited. They're happy. Uh, Sosa comes up with a big hit. Corey Lee had two hits tonight in the ballgame. Benintendi even had a hit. And the next thing you know, at the end of the top of the first, it's 5-0 White Sox. The Guardians would come back. They get a two-run home run, a long one from the great hitter Josh Naylor, their first baseman. It's 5-2. Top of the second, here's where adversity hits. How do you respond to adversity? You've already lost Luis Robert and Aloy Jimenez. Robert, for months, who knows when Jimenez is going to be back. And Yoan Moncada, another veteran player, off to a pretty solid start. Moncada hits one. Runs to first, down he goes, about eight feet short of first base. He pulls his adductor muscle. Same injury that Aloy Jimenez had in the same situation, running to first. What is with this team and their training? Whether these guys don't work out enough or properly in the summer, or excuse me, in the winter, so that they're injured in the summer? Is it the training set? Something's going on here, because I've never seen a team have more muscular injuries than the Chicago freaking White Sox. Now the Guardians come back. They get a hit out of Ramirez. They get another hit. Next thing you know, it's 5-5. And then you go to the eighth, and they've got men on, and Dominic Fletcher delivers. He gets a two-run double, and the White Sox take a 7-5 lead. And then our Chicagoland Chevy dealers, Gold Star player of the game, I'm giving it to the closer, Michael Kopech. He went two perfect innings with four strikeouts. He finished off Jose Ramirez with a just a filthy fastball. Shoo! 101. See you later, Jose. Thanks for coming. Have a good day. White Sox win. They needed it, and they got it. Make sure you get one of those super sweet debit cards, too, at Wintrust.com slash Sox. Take care.